Georgia Tech recognized four men whose courage and dedication changed the landscape of campus. Ralph A. Long Jr., Lawrence Williams, Ford C. Green, and Ronald Yancey were honored with the dedication of the three pioneers and the first graduate statue in Harrison Square. The events on campus began with the 11th Annual Diversity Symposium at the Global Learning Center. Long, Williams, and Green discussed their experiences as Tech's first African-American students, and Yancey spoke about his journey to become the first African-American Yellow Jacket to earn a degree. In the afternoon, the bronze statues were unveiled on East Campus. It was a, just a struggle just to get to school, go through it every day, every week, and try to just be a student. And it was very difficult back in those days. Uh, I didn't have study partners. I lived in another part of town where nobody but me was matriculating at Georgia Tech. So the libraries near me were help, you know, useless really. So all my resources were here on campus. But I actually had to let somebody know when I could be here. I couldn't just come on campus anytime. We thought it was important, given the national context and the climate around issues of race and inclusion in our country, we thought it was important for Georgia Tech to take stock as to where we are with the progress that we've been making on racial diversity for the last 58 years. We thought by bringing the, the original players back from 1961 to help us understand the Georgia Tech of that era, it could better help us understand the progress that we've actually made. And then we would use that conversation to inform futuristically, what are the things that we can do better? ASU, as kind of the voice for the black students at Tech, we kind of owe where we are today and our stance and our progress to these pioneers. We currently have a framed copy of the picture of three of the pioneers sitting in our office as kind of a constant reminder of the standard they set, the struggles they went through, and making sure we never take our place at Tech and kind of in the South in general for granted and that we make sure we always pay homage to these pioneers that kind of paved the way for us. The three pioneer statues are permanently settled in Harrison Square and the first graduate statue will be installed in the G. Wayne Clough Undergraduate Learning Commons. Learn more about these trailblazing yellow jackets at news.gotech.edu.